The sales of homes to applicants by the Post Primary Schools Management Board started since 4th of June 2018 with large turnouts of applicants. But as of Friday, 8th June 2018, the turnout was low as most of the applicants have purchased their forms, waiting anxiously on the queue to submit them. This indicates that the Bindo administration are willing to provide evidence of democracy to the people of the state. We want to say thank you for this opportunity given to us because many applicants are staying at home. So you have given us this opportunity to get a job because there are many that are out there. They don't have anything. So we are Actually, uh, we would like to appreciate this effort because this is uh, something we want in the state. We want him to put more effort since he has done more in the uh, empowerment of workers, because especially people that uh, are staying idle. So we would like to show appreciation actually for what he has. The management of the board has adjudged the exercise as successful with less challenges. The executive secretary of the board said with the extension of the sales of farms, it will enable them to surmount some of the dancing challenges. We have been able to overcome all the challenges facing us. Initially, you know, the first day you have a lot of challenges, but we have been able to overcome it. That is why you can see, if you can go around now, see the whole place is, everybody is busy either building the forms or, or submitting the forms. Adamut Njima, however, warned primary school teachers not to obtain the forms as anyone found will be screened out without delay. First and foremost, we told them that if you are a primary school, if you are, if you are teaching in primary school, you don't need to apply. This is meant for only candidates that are not working so they can be able to have one or two things to do it. Senna Beatrice, 2-6 News.